Hey everyone, let's get started. So for those of you who did not attend my session yesterday on chat app development and streamlining workflows, I'm Mike, I'm a product manager on Google Chat, focusing on our developer ecosystem and platform capabilities for Google Chat. Thanks for attending today. Uh, one of the things that we highlighted yesterday in that talk was about cross product interoperability and data migrations. If you're thinking about moving some or all of your users onto Google Chat. And today I'm excited to announce two partners that we had mentioned yesterday in the chat and also two customers who are already prototyping this. So let's get started. If you joined our What's New in Google Chat session yesterday, we've announced 40 new features in Google Chat and I'm super excited to have you starting to use all these features. Chat is now the best real-time collaboration tool in Google Workspace. One of the things that I am most excited about because my team has worked on this is the new Google Drive uh, app for chat. It now allows you to have respond to comments right in chat. You can actually manage access controls right from chat. It is fantastic. I can't wait for you to try it. And as I was mentioning yesterday, now that chat is ready for real-time collaboration in Google Workspace, if you already have Google Workspace and are using a different enterprise messaging tool and are now considering moving to Google Chat for some or all of your users, I wanted to announce two partners today. CloudFuse, the first Slack to chat migration tool, and Mio, who will be coming up and joining us on stage in a little bit, is the first real-time interoperability tool to allow you to interop between Slack and Google Chat. Joining me now are Anthony and Jason. Anthony is head of sales at CloudFuse, and Jason is the well, one, he has the coolest job title. He's the IT czar at Vendasta. Thanks, Michael. I'm Anthony Raymond, head of sales and uh, strategic partnerships at CloudFuse. And I'm joined on stage here by Jason Kotu, who is uh, a client of CloudFuse. And we'll get to his story in just a moment. Um, but really excited, really grateful to be here, to have this partnership with Google. Um, there's a lot of communication platforms out there. And what you can see on screen here is really the driving business factor behind this partnership. Google and CloudFuse, we want to enable businesses to have the freedom to choose the communication platform that they want to be on, that they want to use, and be able to seamlessly migrate to it. So let me show you how we're doing that with Slack to chat. So just to start with CloudFuse, a little background, we've been doing data and cloud migrations for about 10 years now. We support over 40 clouds. Um, so over that time, we've migrated and do migrations from Box, Dropbox, Ignite, Citrix, to Google My Drive, Share Drive, now Slack to chat, um, as well as numerous other clouds. So really, uh, even Gmail migrations. So there isn't much that we aren't able to deliver into the Google Cloud ecosystem. Um, in addition, we've solved some really unique challenges um, in the migration space. One of them would be embedded links. Our tool is unique in the sense that when we deliver you know, a hyperlink in a document into my drive or share drive, we're able to maintain that link tree um, or go in and correct it from another migration tool that, that it, it maybe broke. Um, so that's, that's really something we're, we're proud of and we've developed as like a unique solver in this, in this industry. Um, and then it brings us to Slack to Teams. We launched that about four years ago, um, Slack to MS Teams. And um, as you can imagine, we're receiving more and more requests. We're receiving about 10 requests per week right now for Slack migrations to, uh, to MS Teams. And that's what sparked Mike reaching out and uh, this partnership. Uh, he had heard from a customer of ours about their experience and things just kind of made sense. We jumped on it and we're able to develop a product that delivers 100% replication on Slack to chat migration. So let me show you a little bit about that. So as you can see on the right, we have two screenshots. We have a scr uh, Slack screenshot and then to the right, we have a Google chat space. Um, all of the content on the left in Slack has been migrated into that chat space. So what we're able to migrate public and private channels, users, emojis, mentions, threads, replies, files. Um, we can even do direct messages, one-on-one -on -one and group messages um, with 100% replication. 
So really proud of that, that we were able to deliver um, in about six months uh, on this. Um, and then on the left, CloudFuse does offer with this service end to end premium support. That we, we know it's complex. You have thousands and thousands of users, thousands and thousands of channels. Um, so we're there in terms of batch planning, consulting, to be your, uh, your, your support team throughout migration. Um, with that being said, a picture paints a thousand words or a demo even more. So I'm gonna start one here that's gonna show a quick migration from a Slack channel uh, to a Google chat space and how user friendly it is. So on screen, we can see just quickly a Slack channel with some content. Files, emojis, mentions. This is the CloudFuse tool, the interface. It's very user friendly. You can see it's a simple click through, a few steps to initiate the migration of a Slack channel to a Google space. We can even change the name if needed through the interface. We'll hit start migration. We have reporting, progress bar, all of that good stuff. So in just a moment, we'll close out that channel and we'll take a look at it from the space side. So we can see that sales space got migrated over all of the files, users, emojis, mentions, replies, threads are all there, 100% replicated. Even the members of the channel are carried over. Um, so that doesn't, doesn't need to be redone. And then finally, I'm sure everyone's eager to know the timeline. We're really excited that we are currently in beta. We're accepting customers today. And uh, GA launch date will be end of the year. Um, I've said enough. I want to pass it to Jason, who can talk to his experience um, in regards to Slack to chat migration. Yeah, thank you, Anthony. Um, I, I'm from Vendasa, and you know, we, uh, as a startup, we were a Google Chat customer, and uh, we really loved the tool. And uh, you know, it, it got us through our startup phase. And as we grew, and Slack got a little bit stale. There wasn't as much development in it and it was missing some enterprise features. And so we went over to Slack, but we kept looking back at chat because it really was our preferred chat application. It, it Even in the old days as Hangouts, it was tighter into Google Workspace. You know, buying from a, a single company to meet, meet your needs is, is wonderful. And so we kept looking back and looking back and eventually this year, we looked back and said, hey, they have discoverable spaces now. That was one of our permission to plays. They, they, they have private and public spaces that, you know, everything that we need there, that the administration panel that I can see all of the spaces, whether or not they're private, this, this is everything we need. Oh dear, we've got eight years of data in Slack. I've got developers designing and features and triaging uh, bugs and red alerts that have come in and tiger teams that have been solving problems that are with our platform and we're, we, we can't leave that data behind. What are we going to do? Well, I reached out um, to our account manager at Google and she said, well, you know, I, I might be able to help you. And that was the start of a whirlwind romance. I think that was 9 a.m. And by 2 o'clock, I had been introduced to Anthony. And he said, yeah, this is something we can help you with. It's uh, now six weeks later. And I've migrated 200 channels with full content, full membership. We've done another 400 channels with just membership because I didn't need that content. Um, it's all been amazing, and CloudFuse has been a, 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 an excellent partner to do this with. Uh, we can't thank you enough, Anthony. Thank you. Thank you, Jason. Thank you. Yes. You know what I'm most excited about is just having that real-world validation of you taking your Slack data. This is production Slack data, and I'm not supposed to mention this, but you're already migrating that into Google Chat when our APIs are not GA ready for migrations, but don't tell anybody. Uh, but I think this is really important to have a partner and a customer validate you know, everything that we've been working on. And hopefully, if anyone is interested in migrating data from Slack, you know, please feel free to reach out to Anthony and Jason. They'll be at the back for a little bit. Uh, but please feel free to ask them how their experiences are, how their data validation is going, all of the 
let's say, stumbling blocks that they might have hit. I'm, I'm hoping there haven't been too many. Um, but, you know, I, I think this is real world feedback that I'm super appreciative for both of you joining me on stage. Thank you.